Ooh, okay. That came out good. I made like a like a vegan London fog with soy milk and it's like really good. I put I put one of those like rock candy looking ass sugar stick things in it and swirled it around. I felt like a goddamn barista, but like I didn't hate myself. <laughs> Happy days, my name is Daisy Mays. If you don't know me, I am a drag performer and that's just, that's what I got going on. Uh, if you don't like that, why the fuck are you here? Get lost, goodbye. Oh wait. Okay, cool, let's do some makeup. Now, I know what you're thinking because as of filming this, I have recently posted another makeup video in which I was just getting ready to make sure I still remembered how. But I felt the need to make this one as well because it, things are a little different. First of all, I'm changing up a few things about my routine. I'm starting with the top half of my face instead. And I also wanted to try out something that just came in the mail today because I got, finally, some Trixie Cosmetics. Specifically, I got the Hotline White Gel Eyeliner because I have been doing my eyes the way that I've been doing them and I had a few ways I wanted to improve that and I wanted to test out a new supposedly really, really great product to do so. Um, and if it works, awesome. If not, I'll kill myself. And I'll do it right here on film. Well, no, I'll have to edit it. So I'll do it right after I schedule things. Cool. And that'll be live streamed. See you there. You know, I can see why I haven't become famous because the universe really can't have me as a liability like that. <laughs> so we're gonna start with a little bit of an unboxing. Don't worry about my shiv here. I'm gonna start with a little bit of an unboxing just to take a look at this product. I've been very excited. I have never gotten a Trixie cosmetic product and I've been a Trixie Mattel fan for years now. So I would very much like to see <laughs> what it is that we got going on. <laughs> okay, I'm obviously struggling with this a little bit, so I'm gonna put on some primer first and then we'll get started. This is it primer plus. I don't fucking know. I I, I don't I don't know how to I don't know how to read that to you. But I've been using it and I like it, so I guess we'll keep doing that since I have no reason not to until it runs out and it's almost out, so we're almost there. My skin feels really nice now. So it's a little disappointing that I'm about to put gunk all over it because that's the hobby that I've found myself enjoying. Now for the record, I'm not getting ready for a show or anything. Um, I just have some stuff that I wanted to film and see, you know, how it goes. And from there, we'll just move on. Oh, look at that artwork. When this, when this box came in the mail, I was so excited. It's been a while since I've been that excited about a package. Cause like this, this cool ass packaging, it really does make a difference. It really is cool. Oh, oh my. Look at those makeup looks. Oh, they're so pretty. That's so fucking pretty. Uh, we got some black tissue paper, which works for me. I'm a big fan. Oh, look at the box for the hotline liner. That is so cute. Oh my God. And it's all flowers. You know I like flowers, bitch. Although nothing I've ever done and no part of my drag persona would ever communicate that to you. So you would be forgiven for um, totally not having an idea. Oh, oh, I'm gonna come. I'm, I'm, oh, I'm gonna ejaculate immediately. <sighs> Look at how pretty that is. Oh shit. That is so cool. <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting, I guess, but like Trixie really does. She understands presentation. I love that. Now I will say I am a little disappointed by how little it looks like there's in here, but like for comparison, this is the black gel liner that I use and this is the Trixie one. It's certainly more liner than like a typical liner would have. I'm just a glutton. I just, I just like more, more, more. So that's not a her thing. That's, that's an issue I'm gonna work out with a therapist just as soon as I find one that my insurance will cover. And I have insurance now, so that's fun. I get to, I get to use that. All right, so what's, what's it look like? Oh, is that a cover? Oh my God, it's a little cover. Ooh, look at that. I know it's not that exciting. It's, it's just, it's white gel liner but it looks really cool. I'm excited, it came with this little stopper too. I've never seen, then again, I'm still very new to makeup, so how would I have seen? Um, well, anyway, I'm excited to try those out. 
Where did I put my garbage? There you are. So yeah, that's that. The primer is probably almost ready to go now. So I'm gonna start gluing down my brows and um, I'm gonna glue down my brows by themselves and then I'm gonna do the whole face. That's part of the new makeup. Theoretically, it'll take longer, but hopefully in practice, it'll just be like, ironically, it'll hopefully make things go faster because I usually waste time doing other stuff flipping around doing stuff while I'm, while I'm trying to make the most of my um, everything. So this hopefully will just kind of cut out the like the, it'll hopefully let me move forward with more certainty. Yes, it's okay that I do other things because I'm currently, you know, letting glue dry. So I'm gonna start by doing that. I'll come back when they're like fully powdered and down and done and then we'll start properly. I'm also trying to do something different where I start with the top half of my face because my nose runs so much. I've got a deviated septum, I've got sensitive eyes. I just have so many factors working against me actually successfully putting makeup on my face. I just sneeze like three times and I gotta blow my nose again now. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna get those bitches glued down and then I will see you when I'm done so that we can start actually doing some makeup. It's gonna be a long night, I feel like. I'm feeling a little, a little sad, a little depressed today, so. It always makes me feel better when I like make something, when I do some sort of art or something. So that's what this is tonight. We're gonna try this new eyeliner. I'm gonna put on about 15 looks that I have and try to film a whole bunch of shit in them. And then we're gonna go from there. See if that fixes me. And if it doesn't, eh, I'll play a video game. Whatever, we'll try something else. All right, mwah. I'll see you in a bit. 20 minutes later. And we are back. All right, it is a little hard to tell, but my eyebrows are covered. Uh, I didn't use translucent powder. I used like a, a pigmented tan, beige, pale shit. Um, and that's, it's what I normally do. And it's fine, it works. If I find something better, I'll change to that. If you can tell me something better, I'll listen to you, probably. I am very bad at taking instructions. So, now, that took a lot longer than I expected to, but that's all right, that's life. I'm gonna get started on the base and I'm just, I'm just gonna go for it. Why not? I'm gonna start with uh, the top half of my face like I mentioned and then we'll work our way down after I've got the details of the eyes done because otherwise this is gonna be a huge pain in the ass. A huge runny nosed pain in the wet, wet ass. So I'll see you all in a bit.
All right, so there we have it. Um, I I really do like this eyeliner. Uh, let me double check that if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I think it has mostly dried matte. I went over it again with a little bit of white white eyeshadow, but it, it wasn't a significant amount. And it's still like, it's looking pretty damn good. So yeah, that is the Trixie Cosmetics Hotline White Gel Liner. I gotta say, I'm a big fan. Um, but in 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 the the defense of those who want to hate on her, um, you know, I don't know what I'm talking about. All I know is that I like the results. Uh, you can keep on hating her if you want, but you know, I I like it. I like her. I'm good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do the bottom half of my makeup, and um, then we're just gonna put on some lashes and then I'm gonna get in gig and go about doing some things for my day or night. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on that and I will see you all when it's all finished. All right, and here is the finished look. Before costume, obviously, but now we got lashes and everything. And I gotta say, I really like the Trixie liner. I think it's doing a really kick-ass job. Here's a bit of a closer look. If you really wanna suffer like that. I gotta repair some of the damage done to my nose. That's what blush is for. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go get in full gig, put on a look and everything, and I will see you in a few. See that? 20 minutes later. All right, and here we are in the full look. I am absolutely giving as much clown as I possibly can. I'm ready to hop into the circus at any given point. Just listen to those words and see if they mean anything for you. The second I start filming, you need to start making noise back there. You need to start making noise back there, bitch. It's every time. You're dead silent until I come down here and hit record. I swear to God, the inanimate objects in my life. Shut the fuck up. <sighs> Thank you for the heating the house, but fuck, dude. <laughs> I swear, the inanimate objects in my life are so rude. I don't know what it is. I don't know what I did to piss them off. Maybe I threw one of them across the room one too many times in my youth. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Anyway, this is the whole look. I'm feeling very clownfish. Yeah, I'm gonna stand by that joke, I think. Um, yeah. I have some stuff to film. You will be seeing this look in some stuff coming up. Uh, but I don't have any gigs to go to tonight or anything. This is one of those rare situations, one of those rare events when I just felt like getting in drag and trying something new. The Trixie liner, loved it, loved it. We'll be using a lot more. I love how it dried matte. I love the vibe and it was nice and easy to apply. Ironically, it went on, it felt like it was an oil base, which is what the clown white that I usually use is, but this doesn't show as much cracking or anything once it's set. And this one also really didn't need to be set very much. It was just, it dried matte pretty much by itself. I did a little bit of eyeshadow to help it along, but other than that, not a whole lot. I'm satisfied, I'll be using that a lot more. 
Uh, stick around if you want to, if you like what you saw here today, or if you didn't like what you saw here today, and you just want to know whenever I post a new video so that you can come shit on it. Listen, I can take it. I'm fine with that. You have to be continuously fucking loud. Bitch. How long have you been silent for, I wonder? One day, I won't be doing this in a basement. That's all I'm saying. Either because I've made it big or because I've quit. Can't wait to find out which. So yeah, some interesting things are happening. Some gigs are coming up. Some projects I have uh, that are just kind of passion projects for myself are uh, right around the corner from being completed. And I would love you to stick around and see if any of it strikes you fancy. And if you did like it, and if you do want to stick around, go ahead and hit that lovely little subscribe button. Maybe hit the notification bell so that you get a notification every time I post something new. Otherwise, comment, like the video, send it to your friends, do whatever the fuck you want. I don't know, it's your life. It's your life, I'm just interrupting it. I'm like a very, very sexy advertisement, but for my own content, so. Yeah. Anyway, thank you all for coming around. Again, my name is Daisy Mays and I'm wishing you some happy days. I feel very cute. It's almost a shame that I'm not going out tonight. Yeah, I bet I can drink at home. I'm tired. <laughs> uh, say la vie.